it's the 18th of Feb and I'm putting my onions and garlic in. I've just got the red onions there at the moment and the garlic there. I know it's probably not the traditional way to do it and most people just throw them straight in but we've just found that we have better success if we start them off like this first. And it's each to their own, isn't it? <laughs> better crack on with the white ones. And there we go, they're done. I think there's like 30 red, 30 white and 9 or 10 garlic. We'll see how they do. Eighteenth of February and the French marigold orange boy are going in. And some more marigold, French orange boy. That's um three parts done of the Aubrey large flowered mixed from Wilco's. We've got the Pansy Fru Fru mix. And then. <laughs> We've got Petunias Multiflora F2. And last but not least, Lobelia string of pearls it's the now the 21st of february and i've just um sewed some lupins gallery blue shades We're now on the 25th of February and I thought I'd just give you a walk around because we have done quite a bit. Grass has been cut. My tea berries still alive. There's that. These are the roses. They're sprouting back up from that one. And the plum tree. It's a lovely day. Got some tulips over there. The snow in summer is still going crazy. Uh, some bulbs in that one. The pond has had a slight makeover. The bricks have all gone, and there's some flowers in there. So they're me berries. No currants. Black, white, red. But it's still dormant, really. This is a bit Rob's dug over. This is where the chicken was. Chicken run. So that's that dug over. There is cabbages, is pride and joy. <laughs> still digging taters up. We've got a nice dinner there. The You'll see the quail shed is gone. Uh, I'm not going to show you around polytunnels because all it's got in it is onions and they're not really changed from last time. It's still got glass and storage and what have you in it. So we'll go up this way. Raspberries. They're waking up. Got the daffodils. Got one half flower in the moment. <laughs> You'll see us new chickens. Compost bin's looking slightly tidier. That that's going to the scrap man. So here are the chickens. That's Derek. That's Derek. We've got two lavenders. I think we'd have to name that one Erica. <laughs> there is a few more in there, but I'm not going to disturb them. That still needs to tidy up. That's better. The IBC, not IBS, the IBC is up there. We've moved that 
arch to the door, to the gate, to the entrance. And we've got climbing roses down there. So we'll take you back down this way. Rob's just done a run, tip run. Get rid of some more rubbish. Again, I'm not going to show you in polyton all. It's just me onions in there, and they've not really done nothing since the video at the beginning. So that's the spinach, kale. That's been dug over. We just thought we'd cover it up, and then we're back to here. Like I said, it's not not a long one. I think the pond area really looks better without all the bricks. And then chill out. Chill out. So I'll just spin you around and give you a view from here. There we go. That is the allotment as of the 25th of February. So I'll see you next time. Bye.